All right, you guys, gals, peoples, everyone, welcome back to the mist. Hello, good morning. How are you? Want to talk to you a little bit? Mm -hmm. Want to talk? Greet. I'm afraid our food. Ah, there's plenty of food. Whoops. Kurt lost control of my cursor for a second there. What's she talking about? Food. There's food. There's water. There's food. There's water here. I'll go kill that coyote to shut him up. We're going to go fishing. Right now we're melting down a bunch of that. Let's go. Do I still have that knife on me? I should. Yes, I do. All right, let's go grab some coyote action. Coyote? Wolf. The heck am I talking about? Let's see if we can get some more food and put it, throw it in the fridge. We got the, the generator running now. Is that is that how far away it is making noise? No, there's another one in this valley here for sure. Pig, pig. Pigs don't... <laughs> having trouble climbing the hill? Huh? You having trouble? Can't get up the hill? Grab the wolf. Alright. Butcher us up a little wolf. Hmm. You know what I'm contemplating? Throwing raw meat in the fridge. See, see if it lasts. Oh, I can actually interact with the door whilst carrying the wolf. All right. Okay. Harvesto. What am I doing? That. I'm doing this. There we go. Butcher. I'm gonna throw. I think. I think I'm gonna try and throw some raw meat in there. See how that works. I mean, it is a refrigerator, right? It is a refrigerator. All right, little head cheese. Butcher time. Mmm, tasty wolf. Get ourselves a little paw action. Yes, sir. Uh. All right, you just bear with me, you guys. We're going fishing, all right? We're going fishing. So this could be... Ah, the lady who thinks we don't have enough food chilling by the fridge... All right, so when I started this thing almost a day ago, almost, 77. So these are all mm, 97 average when we put them in there. All right, let's go. Uh, let's just double check. Oh, jeez. Let's just double check. Oh, they're done. Interesting. Okay, we're going to make gears. Four hours. Assign work to somebody. Scott, you giant doucher. Task owned by NPC. All right. Yeah, it's a good job for you. All you do is stand there and polish the anvil. Oh, my God. He's such an idiot. I'm going to hoof it down there. We've been driving a lot. So, oh, you know what I'm going to do? Uh, instead of I usually just run around. I'm, I haven't visited my old stomping ground up here basically since I moved. Like, <laughs> I, I left stuff up here just laying on the ground, but remember this place, you guys? What is that? Oh, that was a little bear or something. All right, so, you know, I really like this place, right? One, it's at the top of a hill, right? Is where you'd want your house, your cabin, whatever. I like the top of the hill. What I am... Um, what I don't like is it's a little bit busy and a little bit glitchy putting stuff down, right? Like, let's see if uh, this stuff is still in here. Oh, yeah, still in there. So I started building those things around. But to build walls up here, it was going to be, like, impossible. That stuff's still there. And then these things coming back and forth. Look at the shotgun is back. Respawnage. Yeah, I like this place. I do. I I'd like it. I don't know. Maybe maybe instead of being over there, I should have been here using this house. Which, look, if that bed wasn't there and this stuff wasn't coming through the ground, this would have been okay. Right? What the heck? Oh, those are pans. What? 
Look at that salt and, and pencil floating. Okay. And then, you know, I could have maybe walled this in easier around the back here. Oh, out here. Oh, maybe, maybe not. I don't know. I broke the car that was here and then walled it around to where I could still have have this because I, I like this like viewing platform here. You can tell I've been back because loot's doubled up. Been cool. That place kind of could be cool too. Although there's a bear that lives over there. All right, let's go down to the water. Just reminiscing of the days of old when I used to live here. Pretty cool. All right. See how we... I don't know how to fish. I, you know, it was surprising to a lot of people. I, I don't... Never fished IRL. Was never a fishing person. You know? All right. Let's see if I just push middle mouse from here. Oh, yeah. Okay. So... What is that? Zero of 13. Is that the number... Were all those expansions, like, the number of fish that I could have in my fishing bucket, uh, apparently? All right, I'm going to left to cast. I have no idea what I'm doing. Oh, somebody said to cast short, too, because it saves... It saves your uh, line. I guess when you reel it in, you probably are degrading it. Oh. Okay, I, I think I broke it. Huh. Okay, so I tried to cast close and it wouldn't let me. I had to cast out. I don't know. I'm doing something wrong. So I saw like a little thing out there and I left clicked. You see it? Like, is that when you're supposed to do it when that circle goes? Oh, no. Like that. Oh. That line is... Oh. Okay. Oh, Jesus! Don't break... What the... What the actual deuce? Fishing sucks! <laughs> what the heck? What?! My line and my lure? I like saying lure like that. Dude, I stopped. When it started turning colors, I stopped. It got went back green and then it snapped. Oh, snap, dude. Ah, uh, okay. Oh I, oh, I see what we're going to do. I guess I should have brought more lines and lures. I didn't know I was going to lose them. Did we? Yeah, we went to that place. Because I at first I thought it was the bear place that was there. That is just straight rude, man. Break it. The first time I tried fishing, I'd break all my kit. Yeah, you better run, sucka. If you know what's good for you. I got eight more 9mm waiting for you. So if you get close enough and you shoot, he attacks. If you're too far, he runs. And runs pretty far, apparently. Pig eight. You know, it was morning time. I, th I was thinking of breakfast. I mean, this place is really cool here too. Uh, the the aesthetic of the uh, tow lookout tower sticking above makes this camp really cool. But being that it's round, it, I don't know. It's it's all right. I think it turned out okay. I got the garage here and everything. Yeah, it's fine. Like this thing, angled in. Pretty perfect. I just wish they made one of these things without these extension legs. You know, because look at the extension legs are right here. So you can't just kind of zip around in a vehicle. Okay, let's see if Scott actually didn't. You know, he's still polishing himself. Let's go check on that raw meat. Said it was at an average of 97. Pretty good. And these were at 77 a full day ago. So 
I mean, I would ex I would expect the fridge to work. I guess we got to refit our uh, our. Uh, let's try a different lure. This guy, and hmm. You know, at first I thought I had a lot of fishing stuff, but now I can see I don't. I don't. Hmm. I'm pretty sure I put everything in this that I had associated with fishing. Put some of this stuff away, I guess. And the pencils in your life. Nothing in there. It's all clothes and stuff. Speaking of that, what am I wearing? Do I have a helmet on still? No helmet, no vest, no nothing. Just give me one of these. Probably got it shot off. Okay. Not seeing anything. Maybe I don't have any more. Oh, here we go. Here's one thing. Duct tape. Throw a stack of pencils in there. Then all this stuff that's useless. Kind of random stuff here. All right. Let's throw those in there. The problem with having Scott do this stuff for me is it's, it's really slow. I mean, I guess maybe it would have taken me four hours, but... Okay, we're back in business on that stuff. So we've got one line. So if we were to break that again, we've got one another line and lure, a reel. We got another rod. Hmm. Problem is, I <laughs> I just don't know how to. I'm pretty sure the people that told me how to go there. Um, all right, let's uh. Let's cook this stuff because I think Scott's going to take a while. All right, so we're going to need some fuel. I think one will do it. Scott polishing the anvil over there. Thanks for helping. Craft yourself. He's still leaning on the anvil thinking, contemplating life. All right, that gives us two and a half hours to cook stuff. Can't shift click out of here either, which is annoying. All right, cook it up, Bubba. Cook it up. I do. I really wanted to make some stews. I actually, you know what? Now maybe I can because the problem, obviously, was the cauliflower and the carrots and the potatoes. They wouldn't last, right? For enough time for me to get everything I needed to make one of these things. So carrots, potatoes, cauliflower, and potatoes. Pretty cool. A basic meat stew. Yeah. So after you get this stuff, you need to be able to put it in the fridge. I'm pretty sure I was only getting this stuff from bandits. Broccoli. I said cauliflower. Broccoli. And then while we put that in the fridge and we have enough, then we go kill kill ourselves a wolf, you know, while that stuff is is keeping fresh, I'm air quoting, keeping fresh in the refrigerator, right? So I guess that's kind of the balance of it is the, that's where the fridge comes in handy because those vegetables, they really go south quick. Remember the apples I was trying to get? They were they were dying off on me pretty quick too. But me, you said vegetables. Oh, look at this. We I got to take some of this out of here. This is for gunpowder, by the way. Come on. Slice piece of big animal. Imagine seeing that on the menu right here. It says slice piece of big animal. Um, one, please. <laughs> All right. So over here, which is this one? No, this one. Yeah, see, here's my stuff here. This should actually be moved, too, I think. 
this is going to help me stay a little bit more organized. Put it over by the ye old reloading bench. Yeah, look. Boop! Right here. Reloading bench. Oh, and you guys did tell me that, yeah, it was the what the mixture of stuff was. Nothing. Did I just stop him from working? Nope. Oh, thank God. Oh, my God. I thought I ruined it by talking to him. You know, it's it's a little... It's a little fussy, if you know what I'm saying. Luckily, you went back to polishing the... So, it's 11 o'clock. I gave him that at around 7-ish. I mean, if I didn't talk to him, he probably would have been done by now. It said four hours. I don't know. I just don't know. Come on, baby. So, we're going to put these in above 90 percent hopefully hopefully they last i mean i guess you could put the rest of your stuff in there maybe we should make a light maybe we should uh, i'm gonna look and see what else is on the the electrical front all right so start a new row here okay and then we'll take uh this guy we're gonna eat that sucker. Let's see what else is electrified. Cause I did I did this stuff in the first playthrough before they changed it, so I have worked with this stuff. Lantern post light or a floodlight. Position the angle of the light could be adjusted. Required electricity is 75 units. And then we got the fridges. So lights and fridges right now. Although it, you know, it does say that the saw bench needs power, but it, apparently it doesn't. If it did, all I could do is I could relocate it over here. What do you think? Should we make a light? Or attempt a light? The big one. All right. Not this way. Something like that. All right. We need a circuit board, eight scraps, eight components. Roger that. Eight components, eight scraps, and one. Let's grab that crappy circuit board out of here. Ah, uh, the one thing I never look at the tools required to do it. Probably a hammer. Nope, no tools required. Okay. Oh, it works. All right. Oh wow, that's gonna be that's gonna be pretty bright at night. No, we'll try that at night. It'd be cool. Uh, you know, I haven't even climbed up this thing. I haven't climbed up here at all. But it would be cool to have some of those sitting up here, like shining out. You know, and then go out there, then look back at your base. Totally worth. So this is my really poor area of building. But if you look, it 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 kind of goes together more than this does. Let's see how this all did. This is really good. This 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 whole round part here, when I first built all of this, worked really good. Except for this one. Probably because I lined it up there and there. But I did put another stair over here. Okay, you. Yeah, run the other way, son. Makes no sense. You're within a certain distance of that guy. He'll charge you. Just shoot him. He'll run. <laughs> Is he... Oh, my God. He's not done yet. So we have a ladder there. I, I, I'm surprised I, I put a ladder over here. Wow, I could have made this myself twice over, Scott. Like, seriously. And these guys haven't even used their guns yet. I don't think she has either. She has her... I don't know why she carries her her M4 all the way down there. It's a little weird. Yeah, see, I, I loaded a bullet in there for her. She doesn't need any clothes. She's doing just fine. Doing just fine. I really want those dang gears, dude. 
Alright, let's grab the rest of the stuff that we need for this. So, we need six of those. We need ten of those and two of those. Alright. So, two of these guys. There's one. And five. Two of those guys. She really is happy that she's got her own place in here. You know, I don't blame her. She's like, man, this is great in here. I don't have to hang out with Scott. All right, there's 10 of those. And then we need six of these. I think six. Yeah, six and the gears, if someone would finish. OMG. Oh, I can grab these. Look at this. Didn't I have didn't I have three somewhere? What? I use I usually keep my my gears in here. I must I must have made the exact amount for the generator. Guns, guns, guns. Huh. I must have made the exact amount. I had hit... Unless I left those three in there. Because... Don't I have him making like... No, I have him making six, but... If he's only got an hour left, he should be at four or five by now. Boy, you just can't trust Scott with anything. Can't trust him with anything. Now that we were... I made some of those hunting arrows. Um, these guys. Probably ran out of feathers. Because I had stopped collecting feathers. Pretty sure I did. I think I went through all this stuff looking for feathers. Do 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 do. Alright, let's grab this stuff out of here. And that stuff went in here. Of course. Take that out. There we go. So that should be empty. This guy, gloves, empty. And this thing has. Crapola. Take that stuff and put it over here. How's my my stuff doing? My is eighty percent, hundred percent, hundred percent, forty. I think it's because I left the light on while I was uh, crafting something, and it just <laughs> it's like leaving it on for an hour. Whoops. Is that a potato? Look like a potato. I don't think I have any more feathers in here. I'd have to do some collecting. Oh, the thing that's a little bit of a pain is when you, um, you can't, I, I don't think that you can actually charge your light back up until it goes 100% dead, which is not usually that good. There's another gear. So he's got an hour and 12 left. Look at his face. Don't you just want to punch him in the face? Okay, I was going to try and cancel it and do it myself. That was weird. Did you see what I did there? I I guess I just passed time faster. Anyway, either way. We're upgrading the upgrading bench. Okay, upgrade level max. And there was only to unlock hand grenades. So at least you can craft the hand grenades. 
Don't really want to grab any gunpowder right now, though. It's right next to it. I have some gunpowder here. How much did it say it needed? Four? Okay, four per grenade. Four per grenade. I'm not sure I want to use my gunpowder on the grenades, you know? It's like, I don't think I'm going to use those things. So we've got 20 grenade cases, or what do they call these things? Fragments. And we have four actual grenades. Hmm. Neato. Let's check our light. Oh, that's blinding. <laughs> that's pretty bright. It's almost like you'd want to move it, like, back here. At least you don't like get blinded by looking at it. Yeah, it kind of lights things up. I mean, it definitely lights things up. Oh, should we try and fish again? Should we try and fish in the morning? Should I sleep this rain away? Should we go out at night? <laughs> should we go out at night and mess with zombies? I'm gonna refill my water. I'm gonna try and fish again, but I tell you, if it breaks again, I don't think I have any more line. I don't even, I think those are all random finds. All right, it's 1447. Um, anything that's on me is probably getting ruined right now. Let's see if we can sleep this storm away. Nope. All right. Uh, let me eat this guy. I like to sleep on a full stomach. Okay, and we're at sixteen oh one. Let's go fishing. You know what I, I want to do as well? I want to test my theory. I want to go over here to this hunting area bandit camp trigger them watch them start walking out and see if they show up over here like i don't know it took it took like half a day or it was a while i want to say it might have been the next day i was in the crafting bench and all of a sudden i had four or five bandits shooting me like okay i think that one is like programmed to trigger and <laughs> to come after you Should go bear hunting with the with the bow. The bear, there's a bear right over there. All right, let's try this again. Let's right click to reel. Wow, this is not easy. Come on. Wow, you expand your fish bucket, but I tell you what, just trying to get one fish is going to go through all your tackle. I just not—I don't know what to do when it's bending. I'm not reeling. I haven't—I haven't made any ground up here. Jesus. Apparently the devs are professional fishermen because this is one tough fish.
Look at my lure is at 30%. I'm trying left click too, like to jerk the rod or something. I'm supposed to like fight against the way he's going. I know some games are like that. He's going that way. That's a lot of mouse movement. It doesn't feel like that you're supposed to do that. But I tell you, it's not stretching my rod anymore. Doing this. I'm moving the mouse like all the way across my mouse pad to do this though. Okay, he's not he hasn't gotten any closer to me. And my re my look at my lure. 2%, 1%, 0%. Okay, well, at least maybe I didn't break my line. Just the lure. That is really hard. Someone said don't cast out very far, but I was trying to cast close. I had to look way up for it to actually cast the line. My fish bucket says I can carry all this fish, but damned if I can't get one fish. I think you are supposed to like, because it was kind of going left, then right, then left, then right. And then you reel him in from there. You fight the way he's going. Because once I started doing that, I didn't hear the rod bending like it was going to snap. But it never got any closer to me, or at least visually to me, that's what it looked like. Like that the, I didn't make any ground up on that fish. And I'm gonna go bandit hunting. I'm gonna go bandit hunting. Should we try the SUV just to see what like this, you guys said I could drive and aim at the same time. If we take it out, I actually, you know what? It probably needs fuel. The heck out of here, man! Let's call that dude bacon. Can you fill up just partial? Oh, it's got two. It's got two liters in it. That's fine. I got 13 liters, but I don't want to use all of this right now. Let's put this back in here. So it doesn't give us a, a weight on this. So I'm at 47%. Oh yeah, look at that. Are they counting each liter as a as a kilo? Seems like it. Huh. All right, I think what we'll do in the next episode unless you guys ask me to do something else, we're going to try and take out the Looks like it's going to get ripped off by the garage door, but we'll see. We're going to take this bad boy out and see what we can do with this and take it over to a bandit camp and Try and own some face. But I think that'll be good for today. And let's check on our fridge again real quick. So we put these things in above 90. Look at it. 95. It's only still the same day, though. So I've actually killed a wolf and carried four meat on me in my inventory. And used that over a day, two days, three days. So, But it is definitely a lot better, right? As far as making things last. And then we've got, uh, so 15 liters. It's saying only nine hours worth of time. So maybe I should just, I know I've got, I've got um, eight liters in the truck and that seems to last forever. Maybe I should just go ahead and dump all this in the generator. I mean, if we're gonna put meat in there, we might as well. So, four days, 18 hours. Not too chabby. We can collect more fuel while we're out there. Maybe, hopefully. One day. Okay, good. We're good. All right, you guys, that's going to do it for this one. Like I said, next one, unless you guys come up with something else you want me to do, we'll go test out the uh, the 50 cal on top of the, what is that, a Range Rover or something? <laughs> Looks like a Range Rover. Take it out in the old SUV. Test it a little bit. You know, it'd be cool is the seekers don't, they weren't paying attention to me when I was in the truck. If they don't pay attention to me in there and I can take aim with the 50 cal, we can put some hurt on the seekers too. All right, you guys, hit that like, Buto. Join the next episode.